terms of Willen and O'Corn, just just really talented guys, and and they came out every day and, and competed like no other, and um, and helped lead this team, helped lead this offense, and uh, just just watching them go through camp and, and battle it out, uh, you know, it was really spectacular, and um, so it was, it, was, it was really cool to watch see those guys and, and how they handled it too. They handled it uh, really maturely, you know. They didn't they didn't break them apart. They're still they're still friends and. Um, just the way they handled it together, um, the way they came out every day and attacked every day was really impressive. Do you, know, do you know who's starting that game at quarterback? No. Was that a little different than uh, how they handled it last year, maybe? When they, it, it's the same two guys. No, no, again, it was the same thing last year, too. But, um, you know, new year, a, a year older, and um, a year better those guys are now. And um, so just to see that happen every day this year, uh, you know, like I said, it was spectacular. Hey, sir, there, there, have been questions, there, there have been questions about the offensive line because guys that have left through camp. Do you guys feel good about what you put together, or is it still a bit of an unknown? No, I absolutely feel good. Um, you know, we knew we knew the depth we had um, coming into this year, how how talented we were, just just a little unexperienced. Um, but you know, we feel we feel great and confident with our offensive line and how we're going to play. And this so line, what, what excites you about this particular? Team? Uh, just, just honestly, all the new faces. I mean, we got so many guys that they're so young and so talented that they haven't really been able to showcase their, their skills yet because we had so many seniors last year. So, um, you know, in, in four or five days when we go play Florida, um, to be able to watch them for the first time really go and put on a show, I mean, it's just it's, it's going to be unbelievable. And, uh, you know, I can't wait to watch it. Can this line be better than last year's even though you lost all that experience? Absolutely. Um, I think every year. Every year you have the chance to be better than the next, and, um, and hopefully we are. Um, you know, our goal is to be uh, physical um, and just really be the best off in the country, and that's our goal year in and year out. What's, your, what's the night before the open? What's Friday night like for you before the opening game of the season? Maybe some tradition you have or the emotions that you tend to have. No, I try to I try to keep it you know pretty low key. We watch a, a movie as a team every Friday night um, just to kind of get your mind off. Um, you know, ease your nerves a little bit, just take your mind off the game of football for a few hours so you can sleep nice. And, uh, you know, that's really it. If you can just take your mind off, you just – there's so much stuff that leads up to the game, so much stuff you see on, on Twitter and so much stuff you see in the news, this and that, and um, just really getting your mind off it and just being able to relax and go out there and play and relax and play fast. Oh, I mentioned the offensive line being a bit more serious or less joking around this year. Is that just a matter of – Different personalities. <laughs> Kyle and Eric obviously like to have a, a pretty good time last right. year. Yeah, I think just just different personalities, and I think you know the way we finished last year. Um, you know, we lost three games by, by a total of five or six points. Um, just seeing how close we were. Um, I think this year, just you can you can tell how close we are, and um, you know, if it takes being a little more serious to finish those those games, then that's what we're gonna have to do. Did the offense line take some time in particular? Feel feel particularly responsible about the, the close losses or anything like that that caused that? No, no, just I'm, in terms of uh, the team as a whole. You know, we were just just so close, and that's something we preached um, all off season, just just how close we were. So. Um, just, just doing everything we can to, to, to finish reps and, and finish games now, and um, you know that's really our goal of the season is to, to finish games and win, win these games out and win these games, these tight games. Earlier that the, the quarterback was, was communicated. Does he tell the whole team what's going on there? Or are you guys still kind of guessing uh, until Saturday? No, I think they told. You know, he told us a little bit, but um, I think the quarterbacks know more of what's happening. I don't, I don't know. It's not really a question for me. Center is obviously the straw that stirs the drink. How have you seen Pat progress even from spring to now? Uh, you know, really good. You know, Pat's a guy that has been back up for uh, four years, but knows the game inside and out. And um, so him bringing his the knowledge that he has to the game as center is just incredible. And uh, physically too, how how well he's progressed.